with my background in chemistry and all that stuff, it was pretty easy to fly, literally fly through the internet uh, and read all the scientific journals and stuff like that. I devoted eight to 10 to 12 hours a day to it. And now I have over 16,000 hours of reading on the subject. And within three years, I had stopped and cleaned out my entire left main. Cleaned it out. And I've, to date, I have 28 heart scans to prove it. Going back to 2008. 28. One thing that the listeners need to, need to grasp, ketogenic diets are critical. Ex, with the exception of the APOE4 genotype, there you've got to be a little cautious in your diet. The thing with calcium scores, your calcium score keeps increasing. Okay, that means you have stuff growing in your arteries that aren't supposed to be growing there. I, I sometimes call it cancer of, of your arteries. And in 2010, I said to myself, enough is enough. I've slowed it way down. Progression was like a couple of percent per year, but it's still growing. If it's growing, it'll kill you. So I said, I took a week off and I just burrowed myself into my books. And it said, vitamin K influences heart disease. And I went, really? You got to be kidding me. I didn't know it. I truly didn't know it. I got everything else figured out, but I didn't know about K. And I'm going, oh my God, that's what I missed. Because from 2002 to the reversal and cleaning out of my left main, guess what I ate? You can reverse your heart disease. Don't miss this upcoming episode, which explains how. Subscribe above, and don't forget to hit the little bell icon in YouTube, which notifies you of upcoming releases. All we ask to support this free podcast is to share as widely as possible. Thank you.